Okay, the last step is you have to now let's go about the packaging because that is the most important part like how you can basically do the package. Once you export, uh, once you ready your game, like suppose this is the game, I really don't want to do anything for the developing test. So go to the project settings. Uh, the first, first guys, first you have to go to the plugins. And in the plugin, just disable all the useless plugins. For example, for search that Google. And here you find cloud messaging. Bro, whoever using this idiot, this thing. And the online subsystem, you don't really need that. Yeah, the Google pad, you really need that. So keep it that. Then search that Android. And here you find that the device profile, we don't need media, it's based on, on need, it's like if you are playing any video inside of your game. I'm not doing anything, so I'm keeping this over. Android permission, this is really important, keep it live. Android file server, we are not going to use. The Google pad, keep it how it was. Okay, then same thing. Uh, okay, then you search to search VR, see any VR thing is well or not, then search that the Linux. So see, we don't need Linux. Okay then uh vision os i guess vision or just search os let's see if anything with air os oh you can search ios actually you find more, uh, better hardware see we don't need this one ios subsystem we don't need packaging we are wizard we can keep it how it was and lastly let's search that window uh oh sorry windows and here from the window we don't need that uh, lots of thing but i'm going to keep it how it was because i don't want to do anything else with the windows actually okay once you do that now go to the project setting now at here the first thing you have to go to maps and modes to set up your maps you are going to be used okay and then go to the packaging at here you find that include ps station installer just disable it we don't really need that then at here you find the advanced click on split and here you find here the couple of options from here cook only the map uh, are affected on google then cook only the uh oh no we don't need that actually cook everything in the project directory uh ignore list map below okay keep it this one and now at here you have to specify which map you want to include in your package build okay and here's a directory of cooking we don't need to do anything else with this but this thing you have to choose just click to one choose make sure your maps choose your map and once you pick the map you find the big data for example like this uh, i'm going to choose for example like this one this forest one maps and the uh, the maps or view of oh, sorry the maps actually we have to bake the lights other device it won't give you the maps and map build data so just choose that and like set up like this okay then what you have to do lastly is go to uh, the scroll down and here you find call the android oh, go to the android and here you find call this one now in first if it's not coming for your case you have to do proper sdk and dk setup uh so i really have my own sdk and dk jdk system so i'm not dependent on this uh you know android studio stuff and etc so let me just choose my one uh i already give the project file all the sdk link in the description so you can check those sdk link video and you can download it from there okay okay so uh, once you set up the SDK, NDK, JDK, it's really important. Then go to the Android and you can now press on this config now. You can give a restart, it should be okay if it's not pop up in. Once you configure, now you have to set up your com.package name. Make sure guys, never use uh, like this thing. Like, hey, bro, bro, or bro game. Okay, never write this thing like this kind of like a stupid thing. Always keep your company name okay you should have a brand your own personality so suppose you don't have any name you just give think anything suppose like uv Stroff or rockstar or epic game tencent okay for cry call of duty there's a loss of activation like this you can choose anything your company in my case for example let's choose i'll take the uh, studio as my the youtube channel name and then give again a dot and you can now give anything of related to your, your project name for example uh, is uh, the ue Demo. So I'm just keeping UE demo, okay? 
Now, once you set up like this thing, now here in the application display name, that is the thing that uh, what you want to put your game name, okay? The project setting is not actually your game name. So now from here, you can choose the game name, uh, whatever you want, but make sure the Google Play Store, Apple Store have their own character limit. So you have to choose uh, on that uh, limit. So I'm giving name that Unreal Engine. Then demo. Okay. Then the API level 26, that is the minimum, which is Android 8 actually. And the last test we have to choose 34, otherwise, Google doesn't give you permission to export. Then packaging a uh, game inside, yep. Then a chair allow larger OBB files, yep. Then here you find use UV exterior game files, yep. And then you scroll down. Uh, scroll down a little bit. Uh, this is take for the Google Play Store if you're uploading. We are not doing for that, so you can skip it. Then welcome supports. Uh, I'm keeping it how it was. Then scroll down a little bit, little bit, little bit. From here you can choose your game icons and stuff. Uh, now you have, you have question, bro. How can understand the size? So it's 96, 72, 48, 36, 43, uh, 48. So how I know that basically guys, if you hold that, you in the right side in the bottom, you can see the dissemination or uh, the size with a pixel, which is 96 and dimension. Okay. And you can do with uh, the Photoshop, you can resize those. So just keep how you want. Then scroll down and here you find the background. So you can just, uh, this is for Mona Slap Skin. It's good to use their logos because you are using their engine. Okay. But you can skip those things as well. At here we don't need the bluetooth so just disable it now from this is the funniest part actually uh the ASTC gxtc we literally don't need this two thing okay you can go with the astc which is literally 95 percent of google play store device supported now there might be you'll be see that even after uploading this thing with the astc the google was some of the stupid google reviewer out there like uh, most of our uh, from different type of country so that stupid tester doesn't have suppose their android double doesn't support uh support only estc2 doesn't support astc at that point their game will crash on their device and as if they will give you feedback like their game is crashing you have to fix it so it's more like technical problem so for first time upload i will recommend you to upload with the three version it will be basically increase the package size but still after once you upload that second time just re-upload it with just ASTC build it will going to be fix your problem okay nice now at here i'm saying you guys you don't need to do really anything more your game is now ready to package so now just place on platform android now you will see that hey bro why is my android option is not coming just click on here that update sdk because you have the sdk now you have to just give a you know and the good stuff and the engine going to be automatically recognized it because you just set up it so sometimes it's hard to recognize by unreal engine okay so at that point you should set up like that okay now once you have that now plug from android you will be find the android icon so you are ready to export go to the packaging and make sure that it's in a development because we are doing the development one and the stc click on package the project go to the music or wherever you want to export click on select now it will be give you a start exporting and it will be it take around 30 minutes to around uh, one hour depends on your asset pack if you are going to export a default third person template it's going to be probably take 30 minutes depend based on your project uh, the location it's an nvme ssd or hard disk your computer ram row okay processing power and etc so yeah you have to keep it in mind and you have to be patient so i will recommend that if your pc is uh, like potato pc i will recommend give exporting night go for sleep wake up in morning and just check how the bills go okay and never going to be worried with this and warning but yeah if you think that there's any major problem you should fix that and also there's a one more thing the error which is coming the red line those things you should fix otherwise your game not going to be packaged so you have to keep in mind so in my case it's going to be take around a while so let me just export it okay and that's all for packaging the game uh and yeah let me i will upload a second video and there i will show you the exporting the result like after installing my mobile how it's looked